Like, why should I? Why should I even think? Shivani, this is Linda Beza Porter. Um, Josh asked me to give you a call because he's on the taxing on the runway, basically. Um, okay. First of all, this graduation and retention rate, we don't need any comparisons. I know John Haller created comparisons, but legislators are absolutely adamant about any notion of peer institutions. So okay. if you want it, don't we never give that's one of the biggest criticism they say when we ask a question just answer the question don't give us more information we don't want it okay so what we need is those tables that you have would you please immediately wipe out those comparisons and just have 2010 2011 2012 okay I do. Um, I, when I put together, when we put together the table, it was based on the question that was on the memo, and it did ask for a comparison. There is no such a thing for comparison. I have it here. What do you mean? It says, it says the most. They, it did not. It's in front of me, and you send it. You better read it again. It says the most recent four and six year graduation rate, four year institutions only. There is no comparison. Okay, I'll reread it. I, I, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll go check and, Absolutely yeah. But I'll no comparison. I will, I will, I will. Regardless, I will take it off. Yep. Uh, and it is black and white. It says comparison. The second, the word draft makes it shaky. Is either number or not? Why, why is it draft? The dr it's sure. it, it, it is a draft. Because we have not, we did the double checking, but the validation team, the person who generated the data has, generally needs the opportunity to be able to say, yes, this is good. Prior to oh release. Oh my God, how long does it take for the data to be good? Well, aren't we going and picking it up from the federal government website? Why should we double check? Well, because we're taking, we're not taking it verbatim from the website. We're taking it, we're taking it off of the website and putting it into our own graph. If we were taking it, the the copied report off, I would have no problem. But there's always human error, and there's always that chance that it could be incorrect just because of a transposition error. Linda, if it's just a matter of checking, not checking an accounting number, you put this thing and you go to the website and check number by number, number by number. Yeah, and that... How long does it take? That doesn't take 15 minutes. Yes. Right? But... If that's but, what you're talking about, validation, it's just checking the number. Reading 406, this is 406. You know, whatever, 503, 503. I mean, it doesn't need checking and rechecking because you're not recalculating. Correct. Correct. But according to the the structure that we're trying to put in place to ensure that we don't make mistakes in transposition or checking the website. I, what do I say tomorrow? If this should have been done before Monday. What do I say tomorrow when they say, Chancellor, why is it draft? Sir, sir, I understood, and it was explained to me that this was this was only for internal use. Oh my lord! Who told you that this is this is what they mean for it? You have given supplied this information to the president, right, or not? Sir? No, I have not. Okay, this is not for internal use. This is for me that if the president come in and say my graduation rate is 65 percent, I get up and say no, that's not correct. It's 23 percent. So is it not for internal use? And by the way, your email was forwarded to me by Randall. It's not correct. Nobody told you we are not hiding these things. There is nothing hidden about it or confidential about it. This 
letter has gone to the president. But the, also, the representative of Scarpo has asked me that you better have these numbers ready because I want to cross-check it. So that's why I wanted to have it too. They told us to not supply it to presidents. They want independently to presidents to submit their numbers, and they want the chancellor to have his numbers. That was the demand to us. So there's not a secrecy about it. We just wanted them to make sure that uh, if there is discrepancy, I get up and say it. So it's, it's late, and it's a Monday, uh, and tomorrow I have to present, and I have kept uh, Rebecca uh, waiting for me to clean my slides. That's essentially what it is. Uh, so uh, uh, I just don't know what, what else to do. Uh, well, so I don't care about draft or not, you know, just get rid of please that com those comparisons and send it back to me. I, w I will do that. Number one. Number two is that Bismarck State College is incorrect. I, I, oh, by the way, another thing, please. It says what Representative Scarpo asked is four-year and six-year graduation rate. On top of your letter, you said graduate rec uh, rate cohort as percentage of full-time uh, undergraduate as a percentage of total entering student bachelor's degree graduation rate. Uh, rates of full-time, first-time degree certificate-seeking undergraduate within four, six year, and eight year. What is eight year? We're not talking about eight year. I can, if you would like, I will remove the eight year. I don't want the eight year, Linda. I will, I will remove it. So just say within four and six years, period. So, so? every little inf Are you still there? Rebecca, are you on the line? I'm sorry, let me back in two seconds. You don't have I'm going to remove the draft. I'm going to remove okay. the comparisons, and I'm going to remove uh, comparison. Yes. Draft uh, comparisons and the eight year. So just with the top would be four to six year graduation rate, and uh, I, I honestly think I don't need any of those information on the top. All you have to do is remove it and just say four and six year. But there is no six. Oh yes, there is four and six year, and then eight years on the bottom. Oh my God! Uh, may, you know, can we? Can you eliminate that too, please? Yes, I'm happy to do. I, yeah, I didn't notice that. Uh, yeah. And it, so the comparison goes. The top goes. Only we say four year, four and six year graduation rates. Correct. You know, and then on the on the bottom row, eight year graduation that goes too. Yes. And the comparison goes. So it's going to be much the slimmer skeleton. Yes. Okay. So second, the same thing about North Dakota State, uh, I'm sorry, University of North Dakota, North Dakota State, Minot State, all the yeah. four-year college. All, all the okay. way through. Yes, all the way through. And, uh, and as you have it, because we don't have any time, as you have it, just send it to me um, as whatever, you know, as a spreadsheet, the way you have it, the way you have it exactly. So I can shoot it to, to uh, Rebecca, and I'm going to say forget about making it fancy, just make a slide out of it. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay. Now, let's go to Bismarck State. Bismarck State, other community colleges, you have fine. It, it's fine with me. You have it correct. You say that, okay, you have a normal graduation rate. You have 150% normal time and 200 times. Um, you know, enlighten me. Two years, three years, and four years, is that what you're saying? Um. 
the, once again, this is how iPads reported their graduation rates. Not as two year and four year, but as that 200 and 150. Sounds good. And the, and the 150 and the 200 on the uh, two-year schools, correct? Fifteen and two hundred rate published. Okay, let me let me let me help you on that. You know why? Because they have one degree, one degree, one four-year degree. They have probably identified themselves as a four-year institution. You hearing what I? What oh yeah, know? yeah, it makes sense. Now that's that's the whole point. But it's wrong because. You know, we have to really clarify that, and that's a very important issue because, you know, one degree doesn't make an institution for your institution. <laughs> that's true. I mean, uh, what do we want to We, we want to uh, compare the, I mean, we want to make the facts regarding one uh, degree program the facts of life for the entire uh, college. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not disagreeing at all. And that, that's really uh, uh, quite the problem. What I'll, what, I'll, what I'll need to do is, I'll, what I'll have to do is footnote that, that it came from a different, because I imagine that in a different part of the, sti a different part of the site that they do have that the, the two and four year graduation rate for Bismarck, but I'll have to footnote it because it will become from a different source page, which is fine. That, that's, that's all right. It doesn't matter. As long as it's from iPad, it doesn't matter. So, yeah, please try. But first, do me a favor. First, send me these four-year colleges and all the two-year colleges that you have correct. You see what I'm saying? I do. So, I mean, let's, let's send me everything because it's just a matter of eliminating it and cleaning it up and sending it back to me. Yep. Uh, as soon as you can. And then work on this mark. And you see what I'm saying? So, I can, Certainly. while you're doing others, I can ask... Uh, 
uh, Rebecca to make these slides. Sounds good. And then what happens to those three other things that you sent the email that is coming? The th oh, I have sent, I've sent uh, the admin numbers, the um, the admin numbers and a couple other things off to her. I'll have to, I'll, I'll put that, I'll, I'll tell you, I'll include copies of what I sent to Laura when I send you this updated. Please, because she hasn't forwarded to me. She's probably sitting down and checking it at this stage. I'm desperate, so just send it to me. All right. You know, Sounds good. I will, I will do that. I've unchecked rather than not having it at all. I'm sure she will send it to me later, but it's better to have it. So I appreciate that, but this is the most important, this graduation retention rate, and then send those along later. I will do I that right now. Thank you so much. Not a problem. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.